Yo, what's going on guys? It's Invective Minutes back out again with another dope combat video. Or you can call me Invective, but welcome to my channel. Obviously, as you guys know, the Saiyan Day celebrations has all just started and we're gonna go ahead and check out this event. But before we check out the event, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the uh, 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 quick way to actually get the super attack up of one of your characters that you're probably gonna pull. So, as you can see, I have acquired the yeah dokkan festival vegeta uh i've acquired i've acquired this vegeta but i haven't acquired the main physical unit which awakens into the uh transforming vegeta but this vegeta awakens into a super vegeta which is really amazing so i'm really happy that i did get him so i'm gonna go ahead and raise his super attack up and you get you'll get a bunch of these vegetas and you'll get a bunch of these vegetas and all types of vegetas it's best to always raise them up to sa uh not not the sa just uh, raise them up to ssr and then go ahead and feed them in so let's see how it goes okay begin gonna need a whole bunch of vegetas i tell you that much Okay, then we've got two there. Great. Put the guys in. Um, okay, confirm that. This has been using up all of my items, so yeah. But well, it's worth it, it's definitely worth it. Free SA. Don't have to use any Elder Kai's or any of that. Make sure you keep those Elder Kai's safe, you know. They can be used other elsewhere. Ah, there we go, another three, okay. Not far off, not far off. Okay. Hopefully that should do it. And this cross, right. come on. Time for some training. And there we go, ten out of ten. Alright, great. So now this guy is ready for his um yeah, he's ready to be awoken, man. He's ready to be awoken. So let's just go ahead and check out this event. See how good it is. So yeah, as you can see, there's my guy. And I've managed to open up two paths of him already. So two paths open. So let's go ahead and check out the event. Uh, so this is the Earth Shattering Vegeta event. What it should be called yeah earth earth shaking showdown versus vegeta so in this event you'll be able to awaken the super vegeta and the main unit himself so the super vegeta requires 35 medals i would reckon yep and then the main guy himself requires 77 medals as always let's just double check that Yep, 35 medals, that's how much I'm going for right now. And we'll be able to awaken this guy into this amazing unit. Really good unit. I love the card art there as well. I personally wish they made a Super Vegeta where he's got uh, he's got the animation where at the end of the episode, he's literally like, he's gut punching into cell. You know, just like, he just, he's just arrived fresh on the battle scene and everything and he just gut punches him and he's just like, yeah, that's it. I'm screwed. <laughs> I'm screwed. <laughs> this guy's gonna beat the living heck out of me. <laughs> but yeah, alright. So let's go ahead and do this event. As always, guys, if you're liking the content, go ahead and leave me a like. If, if, and if there's uh, plenty more Dokkan stuff that you want to check out, you want to be in the news, you want to be uh, in tune with my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. It's right there over on the right. You know, don't leave that subscribe button just hanging there. Go ahead and click it. I promise you, plenty of content, plenty of great stuff. For now, let's go ahead and jump into this event. So obviously, I'm gonna do it on a Super 25. And hmm, what team should we bring with us? Do you know what? Yeah, we'll bring good old Gogeta team. That's if I had it there. Yeah, there we go. This team should do. I know we're fighting a physical type, but yeah, I, I right. wanted to test out this. strength Gogeta. Oh. <coughs> Sorry. I wanted to test him out uh, on this team, so. 
We'll just go for the key. So there's three there. A couple there. But yeah, guys, please stay tuned to the channel. There will be another summoning video coming up. As you, uh, a link will be in the description to part one of my summons and part two of my summons. So go ahead and check it out. Find out what I pulled, and I will be posting a part three coming up very soon. Now this uh, movie hero slash uh, fusion team is amazing. Just the uh, most powerful team in the game in my opinion. Might be other teams just as good but this Gogeta just gets everything done. Mm. Oh I got a dodge. There's a whole bunch of Vegetas in the game right now. <laughs> all, all sorts of great Vegeta units are available. Ah, here we go, his Super Vegeta form. His big buff form. Alright, let's try and grab a couple of these rainbow key spheres. We'll put him in the middle here. to be there. <coughs> Sorry guys. Yeah, I see you again now. Yeah. 2.3 million. Very amazing. Ooh, 2.9 million on the crit. Yeah, that easy to go Gia, he's a beast. The strongest Super Saiyan is none other than me. That's what you always say, Vegeta. That's what you always say. Never seems to be the case, though. <laughs> you always boast he's the strongest. Alright. So this is his uh, Super Saiyan 2 form. Seems to me like he's getting a beat down. <laughs> oh, he's quite defensive on this one. Okay, okay. Let's see what uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku do. 1.4 million. Obviously not strong enough. Cheers. I'm getting a couple invites from my friends. Alright, 1.2 million crit. Ooh, Super Saiyan God. This is quite a sleek, slim looking Vegeta, but uh, I was never never a fan of the God animation. I don't understand why they're all getting all skinny and small. And just has like, it, it doesn't make sense to me how you get more power just becoming like this. You know what I mean? Like, I understand where you'd get more speed, but power, nah. You'd have to be like quite strong and bulky and muscular to have power. I mean, look at Super Saiyan 4 Goku. This guy's a beast. And you got these skinny god transformations. But you know what? A lot of you guys are a big fan of the god transformations. So I'll rate it as well. I quite love the aura. It's quite, it's quite an imposing stance as well. Alright, so... Okay, we'll do it this way. Yeah, with this God Goku and this uh, Gogeta, they get their max key and they get their max attack and everything because of the amount of rainbow orbs that be on the field. And it's amazing for the LR. Ooh. Ah, he's got something similar to the strength God Goku. That's pretty cool. 
you know what? They need clean animations for the Super Saiyan Gods. They need clean animations. Alright, now Super Saiyan God done. Now it's time for him to go blue. See what he does when he's blue. Alright, Kakarot, say your prayers. I want my guy to go blue as well. All right, let's check it out. Yo, that Vegeta does look quite beastly though. Gonna make sure I get him in them summons. No way I'm skipping on that guy. Mm. There we go. So yeah, this event's got five stages to it. You got Super Saiyan, you got Super Vegeta, you got Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, and then you got Super Saiyan God, now you got Super Saiyan Blue. So yeah, quite a challenging event. But if you got a team like mine, it's not really a challenge, is it? Now? For now, we haven't had to use any items. But if I was to recommend, I'd probably bring King Gamma, Ghost Usher, and some um, support items that can heal you, like Princess Snake and Android 8. Great, great items. I'd use those. They'll get you through any event. You can do most events even with weaker teams. Just like, you know. that there want to get a few of these rainbow spheres there we go there's three so yeah Gogeta gets quite a decent amount from the rainbows and then the god cut the end it one million okay great and then bang, here we go. KO. And you've got seven medals. Alright, great, and that's the event, guys. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Seems like a pretty good event. I can use this event to test out a few of the new units. But it doesn't seem like a, a really challenging event or anything. I'd say right now the most challenging event is probably the Super Boo. Um, his event. But yeah got a whole bunch of missions whole bunch of stuff to do still got some dragon stones to collect got a hundred stones at the moment so yeah make sure you check out that part three it'll be coming i'll put part one and part two in the description down below go ahead and check them out on the summons but yeah we're gonna continue with the summons continue with the videos and everything it's all pumping out the same day stuff has just arrived there's plenty of do on dokkan but yeah anyways guys that's invective menace or you can call me invective make sure that you go ahead and leave a like and i'll catch you guys in the next video make sure do you know what do you know what do you know what? i'm not just gonna leave you like that please go ahead there's a big fat red subscribe button over there on the right don't forget that go ahead and click that and there's a playlist in my channel go ahead and check out the other dokkan battle videos plenty of great information loads of great stuff but that anyways that's enough self plug from me i'll catch you guys in the next dokkan battle video this is your boy invective peace out